Affairs, Shipping and Mobile World Congress. We're with Corning Gorilla Glass, and uh, in previous years I've actually been able to, to smash it myself, but this year we've got this contraption. Uh, before we look at that, there's the details on where Gorilla Glass 1, 2 and 3 go. This is uh, Newton's force on the scratch test here. You can see that Gorilla Glass 2 was scratching at uh, 7 Newtons of force. Gorilla Glass 3 is now clear to 7 Newtons, and you've got a small scratch with 11 newtons there but let's do the uh, let's do the test here and what we're going to do roll a ball down onto the glass and see see what happens yeah that's correct okay so we have an incline that's set up at 10 degrees yeah and we have a 135 gram steel ball first i'm going to show you an alternative chemically strengthened glass that's available in the market right. it's just in a mock phone holder here right okay and this glass has been scratched similar to the one you showed over all there all right so it's got okay. wear on it already. And I'm going to okay. the pin and allow the ball. Let's see what happens. And there you go. That smashed. Well, you can see that glass did not survive. Yeah. And the fracture oriented from the crack. Okay. So the next one is Gorilla Glass Three. Oh, so this is the latest Gorilla Glass Three. Yep. Again, scratch. Seven Newton scratch. So this is seven Newton's force on this, yeah. This is about point um, one joules. Which is how does that relate to? Well, this is an impact energy. Oh, okay, so. You can see, even with a couple of bounces there, yeah. Gorilla Glass 3 survived. There you go. But just to give you um, an idea of what we can really handle, we're going to increase this angle three times. Okay. okay. It's going to increase the impact energy three times. So, three and joules. Point three joules. Oh, point three joules, have, sorry. So now I have a piece of aluminum. Yeah. I'm going to put it in here. Okay. Oh, yeah. So you can see it yep. formed the aluminium there. Yep. Aluminium here. Yes. Not aluminium. <laughs> <laughs> so that gives you an idea of the amount of impact yeah. that the glass is seeing. Okay. Okay. So now we so that's have a pretty hefty, uh, hit. another piece of Gorilla Glass 3. Yep. yep. We're going to hit it at the higher impact energy. And here we go. Even a couple bounces, Gorilla Glass 3 still Everything survives. Looking great. Good. But that's not it. We're not going to stop there. We're going to take this piece of glass. Again, it's been scratched. It's also been impacted with the ball. We're going to put it over here on our press. And if you look here... So this is the meter. We're going to put 100 pound load. Wow. And it still survives. 100 pounds. So that's like 45 kilos of load on there. So even after the dynamic yeah. impact and the static impact, this great Good. piece of Gorilla Glass 3 still survives. Excellent. So when will we expect to see these in, in products, do you think? Hopefully mid-year. We're working with our, our customers now. Uh, yeah. In 2013. Good. All right. Well, thanks for the demo. See you next year for Gorilla Glass 4, maybe. We'll see. Thanks. It's Chippy at MWC with Corning.